Hello guys, KP Shamino hier uh, with another guide for Voodoo Lake. Some strange things happen today. The guys know that saw me streaming today what I'm talking about. So I'm going to show you guys how you need to get the white sucker. Some people say the carp, but that's not really wrong because the white sucker is like family of the carp. So that's the carp in Colorado. So you need to go to the fantastic fishing and what you need to do is you need to throw in front of me there is like a square rock and if you look really good it's like a mask in a stone and uh, yeah that's where you need to throw so you don't need to make a lot of distance you just need to throw here at the reflection to the mask it's going to be eight meters and that's more than enough you can go a little bit further, 9, 10 meters, it doesn't matter a lot, but you don't need to go 30 meters, because that's uh, not really needed. So let's have a little bit of time to just check out that I can maybe get a bite in the movie, it's always handy. And I, yeah, I think I see some tension, yeah, yeah, um, yeah there is not another fish that like bees here. So I'm almost sure it's the white sucker. Yeah, and I think that is stopped. Yep, yeah, so it stopped. So I cannot show you guys. Sorry for that, but that's the position. So, oh, no, no. I just wanted to reel in and on that moment I saw some tension again. So let's hope that I can get one because I think it's beautiful fishing. The ones that are sitting here are a little bit smaller than the one in Alberta. It's uh, like three or 400 gram less. So they are 1.3 kilograms and those in Alberta go to 1.7. So uh, yeah, I think it's the environment. I think it's not deep enough that they get bigger. So Okay, come on mate. Bite a little bit. Yeah, he's, he's like... It's like a carp. A carp does just the same. He just plays a little bit with the bait. And then once of a sudden he goes away. Yeah, here he goes. So let's get him in. And here you will see the white sucker. So a little bit smaller, only 1.4 kilograms. He gives 45 experience with premium. And how do you need to catch him? He's a bottom feeder. So bottom feeders always means that you need to fish on the bottom. So my setup, Telefloat 650, my Prima 3500, I'm using Brett 0.15, I'm using the Sport Floater and the Hook 1. The Hook doesn't matter a lot, you need to be sure that you don't go too high, because I already said in this area there is not another fish that eat peas. So that's only the white sucker, that was, maybe a bluegill, but I don't think so, not that deep. So you need to go maximum depth. 250 centimeters as I already said a bottom feeder so let's go to the net and here you see what happened today really strange stuff yeah that's from my other movie uh, I, I tried corn and on one moment I got a young cutthroat trout that's that's yeah that's magic because that's the first time that I see a trout eating corn it's maybe my problem but I was thinking, yeah, let's do corn for the white sucker. It will work too, because it worked in Alberta. And once of a sudden, I had a cutthroat. I thought it was a bug. But the next time, I had a cutthroat too. So, it's strange stuff, you know. Very strange stuff. But you guys will see. Peace work really well. Get some peace on. Uh, the reward is 6 currency, 39 uh, experience. I cannot say more about this fish. So, that's how you need to catch him. Uh, if you like the movie, give me a like. Otherwise, have fun with the white sucker. A good fish to fish on. But I think experience-wise, I think he's a little bit under the cutthroat in weight. So, that's how you need to catch him. Thanks for watching, guys. See you later and bye-bye.